Music Lovers is the magic of a 100-watt, five-channel surround sound audio system. Installed by yours truly. Oh, hey, what happened? <gasps> oh, no! It better not be broken. We can't have a party without tunes. But uh, it can't be broken. I did everything the manual told me to. Mostly. I'm sure it's just a glitch. I thought you said you knew what you were doing. Well, I did save us money. I mean, a technician would have cost an extra $20. That stereo cost us $500. It was practically all the money we had. And we need it for the party. Not to worry. I'll fix it. No! no! Uh, I've seen you with frizzy hair. Trust me, it's not a good look. <sighs> I'm sorry, guys. I guess I bit off more than I could chew. Guys, this thing is majorly fried. We can't even afford a repairman. Wait a minute. This article I'm reading, it's called The Wonderful Law of Karma. The Wonderful Law of what? Karma. It says that because of good karma, this woman became a millionaire. Here, Mabel Whitaker donated $5 to charity and the next day she won the lottery. Really? What's karma? Basically, the law of karma is that if you do something nice, something good will happen to you in return. I do nice things all the time. I've never paid attention to what happens back to me. Don't forget, it can go both ways. Bad deeds can come back to you too. Like me, wanting to show off by putting together our sound system. Exactly. So, if we do some good deeds, they could make us rich. And we could buy a new stereo. Oh, come on. Karma only works if you give unconditionally. You know, not expecting a million dollars in return. What do we have to lose? Yeah, let's try it out. Aren't you coming? Nah, I think I'll conduct a little experiment of my own. Can my last five dollars, if taken to the mall, be converted into a decent birthday present for my Aunt Norma? This scientist is skeptical. Hey guys, no time to hang? Oh, sorry Eaton, we're on a mission. A mission? What kind? We're testing the theory of karma. Ooh, I see my first opportunity. Need some help? Sorry Eaton, our tunes are in jeopardy. Huh? Help you, ma'am. Well, thank you, dear. No, no, let me help you. Hey, I was helping her. Uh, no, I was first. Ugh, kids these days, they're always so polite. Like to smell La La Lovely, our new perfume? Yeah, fun. Ooh, La La Lovely. I heard this was scentalicious. Uh, yes, excuse me. I can help you with La La Lovely. Not 
and delicious. <laughs> I'm sorry. Sometimes it takes a while to find your perfect scent. I wonder how long it would take you to find a new job. Yes, Will, help yourselves. There are more samples on the counter. <sighs> yeah, right. And as soon as we spray any, you'll charge us a fortune. We're on to your greedy ways, you miserly old merchant. Every sample on the counter is free. If you'll excuse me, I have some urgent folding to do. Huh, she's not very nice. But what else? Let's go shopping. Wait up. Didn't you hear what she just said? Urgent folding? Well, the sweater display does look shabby. Uh, before that, look! Every sample on the counter is free. But how do they make money if it's free? Duh! They, like, get you hooked. Then when you use your stuff up, you have to buy more. For, like, money. <gasps> that clever, miserly merchant. But we'll outsmart her. We'll take all this free stuff, but then switch to different stores and take their free stuff, too. That's what I call shopping! <laughs> doing? Duh, taking free samples? Yeah, they were on the counter. That doesn't mean they're free. It's stealing. It's not! Put it back, quick, or you'll get in trouble. Find hey, it. stop it! it. Uh-huh! I caught you, crooks! Oh, no, there's been a misunderstanding, right? You're the misunderstanderer. Ma'am, Honest, I was trying to get them to put everything back so they wouldn't get into trouble. Uh, come on, tell her, guys. <laughs> like, as if. I don't even know what you're talking about. <laughs> nice try, ladies. Work your cover story out better next time. A cover story? Blah, blah, blah. Can we go now? Because my sister and I would like to enjoy our giant bag of free stuff. Oh, no! That stuff is not free! It... huh? But you said... And you're all coming to my manager's office for shoplifting! And even after they understood that taking the merchandise was wrong, they wouldn't stand up for me. Can you believe it? That's pretty horrible, even for the Tweevils. Yeah, so much for your theory of karma. I try to do the right thing for those pink beasts, and now I have to spend Saturday doing community service. This should put an end to your adventures in karma testing. Mmm, well, not exactly. What? You won the lottery? Almost. We were just five numbers off. <laughs> so we figure maybe if we pool our karmic powers, you know, do something really good all together, we're sure to get a payoff. We're doing volunteer work tomorrow. Together. Yeah, for the super altruistic organization that plants trees. At least you'll be doing something good for the environment. And getting rich in the process! Oh, but our thoughts will be with you, of course. Whatever horrifying place you end up in. Well, 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 what have we here, hmm? 
a hard-boiled group of criminals. Y'all are here because you have done a disservice to our fine community. You will make up this community disservice with a day of community service. You get it? Yeah, anyway. My name is Willie. You will address me as Ms. Willie. Your day will consist of going around this beautiful park, picking up trash! No talking. Now when I blow the whistle, get to work! <laughs> Ew! I haven't held a trash bag since I threw away that icky old scrapbook from Grandma. Welcome to the jungle, noob. Oh, brother. Huh. And what have we here? Ugh, hurry up! Jab it! Come on! My arms are sore. Uh, I can't get it off the stick! Allow me, ladies. Aw, oh, you poor little princesses. You're much too classy to pick up trash. Well, yeah, huh? Oh, let me do it for you. It would bring me to serious big tears if I saw those cow chur outfits sullied. Like, duh, scary girl. Cow chur? These clothes aren't even leather. Uh, I think she means couture. And thank you ever so much, scary girl. Looks like I got me a couple of slackers! Where's your equipment, slackers? <gasps> oh, we're much too classy to pick up trash. Yeah, that girl over there is picking up our trash for us. Weird Wilma. Hey, Wilma! You picking up their trash? Huh? I never talked to them in my life. <gasps> <laughs> you think I'd believe that story? Huh? That's government property. You're gonna have to pay for it. What? Oh, wait, 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 wait. She saw the whole thing. Yasmin, tell them what happened. As if. I have no idea what you're talking about. Oh, enough dramatics, you devious Debs. Get back to work. <laughs> but we don't have any trash pickers. Use your hands! All fours, ladies! <laughs> Maybe there's something to this karma business after all. I guess what goes around, comes around. Aw, oh, gee, what a shame! Hey, like, leave us alone. We didn't do anything to you. Uh, I beg to differ. You offended my sensibilities. You see, it hurts my eyeballs to look at you. Gosh, like, mean. Don't even, like, talk to her, Casey. She's trouble. Lucky for you, my little sunflowers. I will allow you to make it up to me. A start would be if you picked up my trash. Because I was up late hot-wiring some cars, and I need shut-eye, see? Go on, clean it up! Like, like yes, sir. sir! Hey, what's your problem? Leave them alone. Did you hear something? Because I didn't. Hey, you, give me your hair scrunchie. I need it for a slingshot. I'm gonna take out that guard. Leave the scrunchie, Kirsty. Hey, I'm not through with them. Yes, you are. Oh, really? Says who? Says me. Didn't want a pink slingshot anyway. Oh, you could have been exterminated. You saved our lives. And my scrunchie. You guys can get the rest of this. Hey! Ah, uh, so, nice job. You passed my test. What test? Oh, back there! You stood up to me. Now I know you got what it takes. What it takes for what? Shh! Only a girl with nerves of steel is good enough to join my gang. And don't even think of backing out, because I got friends. What are you talking about? We're busting out of here. And now's the time, while Ms. Willie's not looking. You want to run away from community service? You got it, tough stuff. Ah, lunchtime. 
Your cheek's up! It's now or never! You'll never catch us, copper! Oh, help! Kirsty! Casey! Like, oh my gosh. Yasmin's been abducted! She needs our help. But it's like time for lunch. Oh. Oh, great. Look who's here. Where's Yasmin? <laughs> Yasmin and Wilma are on the run! Jailbreak! Jailbreak! What are you talking about? She, like, got nabbed by this fashion challenge girl, and they are running away from the long arm of the law. And it's all our fault. <laughs> she saved our lives. What? what? What's all this about? You'll never catch us, Copper Freedom, ha-ha! And who are you? Which way did they go? Follow us. Hey, wait for me! Let go! Sheesh, tough stuff. It's almost like you didn't want to escape. Did you know we're heading east or southwest? I guess I forgot which way the highway is. The highway is back where we were. Okay. Uh, so which way is that? Sorry, I wasn't paying attention. I was too busy trying to keep my arm in its socket. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? Maybe a tiger. Ah, tigers! <laughs> I'm just kidding. Gosh, what is with you? Well, I don't like it out here. The woods give me the creeps. Then why did you drag me out here? Because maybe I... Because maybe I thought you'd want to join my gang. Oh, yeah, about that. Just where are all these friends you have lurking in the woods anyway? Well, actually... You see, I... It was all a lie, wasn't it? If you'll excuse me, I've got to find my way back. No! Please! Don't leave me! I'm not out here in the woods! You're not even all that tough, are you? <laughs> oh, calm down. It's just a... a She was right. Scrunchies do make good slingshots. You saved my life! Uh, nuh uh. We saved Yasmin's life. You saved us, so now we saved you. <sighs> I'm so glad to see you guys. What are you doing here? Our tree planting. Remember? We came over to see how you were doing. <laughs> Is everyone okay? Yes, ma'am. Thanks to these girls I was so mean to, and... And it's all my fault! So please don't blame anyone but me! Uh, actually, it's partly our fault, too. What? Like, back at the store, Dopey. We, like, let Yasmin get in trouble when she didn't do anything wrong. She was only trying to help us. Oh, yeah! We'll tell that store lady everything! I never thought I'd see the day. Well, tough stuff. I guess this is where we part ways. Uh, after all that? I don't think so. I think there's a little something you can help me with. Hit it! Woohoo! You fixed it, Wilma! Wilma, you're a genius! Just in time for the party. Thanks for inviting me! You got it! Isn't it funny, pretty princess? Because of your good deeds, our stereo got fixed. 
So, does this mean your days of tree planting are over? No. We enjoyed it so much, we signed up for the next weekend, too. That sounds great. Wilma, wanna join us? Good deed, I'm gonna teach you all how to dance! <laughs> <laughs>